is the BBC. Today's headlines. Chinese EU free trade agreements are being currently in negotiation and in discussion. Our other story today is that the BBC arm of policy is currently launching an investigation into what it feels is an abuse from the British government. On the first story, Chinese and European relations have both suffered and improved in the last uh, hour or so. It appears that the Chinese are offloading Europe bonds. When asked about the reasons for this, the propaganda minister of China reported that Europe is no longer a viable economy and China cannot invest in uncertainty. Now, when pressed about the EU free trade agreement, Chinese propaganda minister Marine Ote reported that, yes, China is very much invested in launching this. When asked whether the first agreement of offloading eurobonds and the second of launching a, a free trade agreement conflict, he merely laughed and said, buying goods in a country and investing in a country are two different things. If European citizens want Chinese goods without a tariff, who is in their right mind going to stop them? On another news, the BBC is launching an official complaint against the UK government. Whilst the, UK, whilst the, whilst the BBC is funded partly by the government through television licenses, it appears that recently the British government have trespassed uh, on BBC's neutrality. The BBC is launching an official complaint on an ombudsman and is hoping to have results in the next few weeks. Whilst the BBC maintains its position in holding policymakers accountable and in reporting to the very citizens who pay for its production, the UK and Britonians, essentially the BBC cannot be biased to its government. We have a duty to report the news as it occurs and to inform the public as we are instructed. This is Amal Ali, reporter for the BBC.